Good morning, good morning. Welcome back to Morning Motivation with Matthew Daniels. And today I'm going to tell you guys about the world's first matriarchy. That's right, the world's first matriarchy. But what is Matthew Daniels talking about? Um, a long, long time ago, in the area of the earth that we call Iran today, there lived a king who ruled the vast kingdom. This king's bloodline went all the way back to the man who was the first king in their history. This king did like all kings do and set about creating an heir to the throne. His queen first gave him a daughter and then she gave him a son and heir. As his children grew, his daughter was married off and she gave birth to a son of her own. His son stayed close by his side until the day that he died. When the king did die, as all men must do, the son became king. Then, being corrupted in his mind by those wanting to manipulate him, the prince turned king gave his assassins the most heinous order. He sent them to go and murder his sister and her son. Without hesitation or second thought, they set about to accomplish this task. One night, while the daughter and her son slept, the assassins arrived. Before anyone could react, the assassins plunged a dagger into the child and were going to plunge a dagger deep into the head of the daughter next. The assassin stood over her body and raised his blade high. Then he brought it down with tremendous force. Just as he did, the daughter was awakened from sleep by something that no one could see, grabbing her hands and making her grab the assassin's blade at the very last second. Her hands were cut and the tip of the blade pierced her left eye, but her life was spared. The daughter, who stood six feet tall, snatched the assassin's blade and defended herself with it. As she fought, she realized that her son was dead. The daughter let out a cry so loud that I am sure the very son could hear her. Then the daughter blacked out. When she came to, she was covered in the blood of others and she was now holding two daggers and standing on top of her deceased attackers. The daughter, seeing how low the patriarchy had sunk, declared herself the supreme ruler and established the world's first matriarchy. She then made the finest craftsman create her a new eye, an eye which was constructed from the purest of elements, inlaid with strings of gold, and an eye which had the very rays of the sun carved into it. When the supreme ruler ruled, the entire land prospered. When she died, her daughter ascended to the throne. And this, according to my ancestors, was the world's first matriarchy. And so, the morning motivation of today is the world's first matriarchy. Never let society dictate to you your limitations in life and never be afraid to change what's considered normal. It is the responsibility of the righteous to challenge unrighteousness wherever they may encounter it. Today, I want you to remember something. You did not come all the way down here to planet Earth just to live inside of someone else's box. You will do everything that you have set out to do and you will achieve every goal that you have set. You will rise to every occasion and you will do what needs to be done. So, become the best version of yourself and go out and do good. And remember, you are awesome, you are amazing, you are wonderful, and you are great. And you are going to change the world. I just hope I'm still alive to see it, family. I'm out. Good morning.